Dion Wynn. Hi everyone, welcome back, maybe welcome to the very first time. I'm in here again with another review for you and a review of one of the channel's very favorite directors, Francois Ozon, and his latest film, Everything Went Fine. He is a filmmaker that has continuously kind of engaged me and I love, I would say, 90% of his films. There are a couple we will not talk about here. But with Everything Went Fine, I actually got to see it last year and I wasn't overly sold by it, but recently I did rewatch it. And well, there's a lot to talk about, so let's get into it. The film follows the story of André. He is 85 years old and has suffered a stroke. Emmanuel hurries to a father's bedside, sick and half paralyzed in his hospital bed. He asks Emmanuel to help him end his life. But how can you honor such a request when it's your own father? I think over the last couple of years, Ozon has channeled a lot of raw questions that are rarely discussed in society and by the grace of God is a prime example talking about abuse within Catholic Church and here he tackles euthanasia with such humility, such humanity and very aggressive dialogue and I think this is Ozon at his best and I really couldn't tell you why it didn't connect with me the first time but as I re-watched it I thought to myself wow he is kind of giving such a familial connection with this film because this is the fundamentality of it is kind of a father asking his daughter to end his life. This life has completely changed for André and he does not see a future for this situation that he's in. And I think as you kind of go through this, the moral dilemmas and the moral compass of it all really hits home because he asks you, what would you do in this situation? And this is what these types of films should be doing. It's a, it's a topic that it's, it's not discussed. In the UK, it's something you rarely hear about even, but it's something that people are doing in the world. And I think asking your child to help you with this is massive. And I think when you see Emmanuel and the way that she kind of goes through the day to day, because this is set over a long period of time. So it's kind of in vignettes of kind of the beginning of André's stroke to how the film ends and I think this journey of her accepting what her father wants is beautifully fascinating and utterly challenging but this is the thing it's not all hard hitting there are some really heartwarming moments where you kind of see André in his kind of day-to-day -day life but with adjustments I think there's a scene in a restaurant where I thought to myself you can sense how happy he was in that period of time and what he wanted and everything was as it was and you kind of realize then things are about to take this turn and I think Ozon does it in such a still way but the dialogue itself really kind of invigorates the conversation and really invigorates what is actually going on and the film has this very fascinating blue palette that kind of sets this kind of tone of kind of a a change in the air really and this kind of sense of a a a transition within the family dynamic and I think you get to see this film through the eyes of Emmanuel and you see what is going on and you actually get to learn a bit more about euthanasia which is actually quite fascinating and I have to say André Dossilier he is phenomenal in this film he brings such humility and passion to a role that would be challenging for anyone but I think his understanding of the topic clearly kind of drove him forward and you can say the same for Sophie Marceau, uh, who plays Emmanuel the daughter I, I think she's the eyes to it I love kind of the close-up framing that Ozon provides through her and this sense of express expression that she delivers is really powerful. And I really did think that this was an absolutely fascinating film and a film that I think a lot of people should watch. If you're an Ozon fan, you will, you will dig this quite a bit. And I think these types of films that he's doing, I love them. I think he should be making more of them. I think this is a very different kind of 
ozone to an ozone that we saw 20 years ago. This is a this is a, an adaptive ozone and I, I love it for it. So that was my review of Everything Went Fine. If you've seen the film, please let me know in the comment section below what you thought of it, as I'm always intrigued to know what you guys think. And it will actually be out in UK cinemas in June. So please do keep an eye out for it because it is really something that needs to be seen. And I will be back with another review very, very soon. Thank you very, very much for watching. Like, share, subscribe, do as you please and take care.